All right, it's time for round two of the Victra Cup. So last round we used this team of uh, Nasha, Murmur, and Miranda. I don't know what to expect from my opponent this time, uh, so I think I might just go with the same setup and hope that they don't have a fire unit <laughs> like last time uh, to kind of wreck my day. But I'm also kind of considering doing some sort of DPS unit to get quickened with Miranda. So my other options would be something like a Mish or a Gafgarian's actually not a bad idea. Uh, I think I finally got him to a point where I'm okay with him. So let's go take a look at him real quick. Uh, his abilities aren't maxed max, but they're still pretty solid. Uh, the only issue is if they are expecting any sort of... Um, they might be expecting Gafgarian as an option. So, so Gafgarian is an option. Um, other MRs I could use. So Salir's, I mean, she's probably usable, actually. So if I put Salir in. <clears throat> let's do, okay. Now Esper-wise, I don't want to put this on Miranda right now because I don't want her to be super weak to Lightning. Uh, that's kind of why I like having Golem on her. But I would want Salir to have Golem because, uh, well... Hmm. See, there's a lot of considerations, because Salir can go, I believe, with... Oh, she doesn't have Odin yet. So she can go with either Golem or Shiva. She's close on Ramu. She's at 8. So, But Shiva gives more agility. I'm trying to get one more level, too, to get that last point of agility. Um, Let's see here. But I'm a little worried this is too... Like, I have two kind of semi-tanks. Hmm. That can make Salir really beefy. And it'd be nice to have guaranteed hits for... Um, other for the uh, really evasive units, but I, I feel like I just need to stick with Nasha and go with the game plan from before of just kind of Nasha buffing everybody. And then we have uh, Murmur and Miranda both kind of semi tanking with their gear combinations and the Leona's Castle here and the Golem on her. Make sure I have the right sub jobs on White Mage. Good, Black Mage. I forgot to change it for Guild Battles today for Nasha. It's pretty bad. Time Mage. Yep, we got all the stuff on. Some jobs. Gear. Alrighty. Putting Nasha up front lets me swap out too. Oh, interesting. I like that. Well, I don't like it for Murmur, but... I do like it for my Nasha being an actual tank. <laughs> and if he's chaining with Lucia and Phoebe or something... Oh, we can't use Phoebe, actually. Now we're going here, though, because if he has steel time, it's going to be on somebody that's fast, because there's no uh, SR that he could be using since he's using Sasha. <clears throat> oh, I always get nervous right before the matches. <laughs> but once it starts, we're good. All right, both say good luck. Let's go. Is it a steel heart team? Oh no, it's super evasive though. That's not good. Should have brought the Salir. <laughs> Enemy spotted. Actually, Engaging. didn't change positions. I don't think. Was it Shiva? Yep. Yeah. Oh, he doesn't have the luck card though. She's gonna probably do her thing, a little evasive thing. Moving strangely. Utsusemi, probably. Maybe hide just to do a move. Yeah, okay. Just to build some AP, but not committing to anything. Yeah, these guys are fast, though. They're going to lap me at some point, most likely, which is pretty rough. Alright, that's pretty bad for me. me Definitely me wishing I brought Solir now. Although, I guess Nasha's really good against... Uh... Actually, no, we want to put haste on the Nasha. We're just going to make him come to me, though. Because those guys are so fast, I have to save that CT.
We are going to move her up by one, though. So her CT is a little less good, but... Alright, let's do... Where are her stats? Pretty good agility for being a Sasha. Only 2.1k health, though. That might be a Miranda kill. One, two, three, four. Okay, he's one space away. Sad. I don't think he's a, he's gonna Utsu semi now, probably. Oh, Decider of Fate? Interesting. I'm curious to see what the percent to hit is. Delusions on. I wish it would just show their evasion. <laughs> oh, man. Here comes the damages. Let's just see what the chance to hit is here. Zero? Oh boy. That's not the greatest. Oh, excellent. What's up, Mom? Um, Alright, so I guess we're gonna do... <laughs> we're gonna haste on Murmur. And we're gonna move back, make him come to me. I can't fight this head-on. I wonder if I can... if I'm in range for Stone Aga, though. Or Stone Arrow, sorry. 0% to hit. Holy moly. Well, this is just rough. Oh. Just gotta do this. <laughs> They're both gonna get turns, though. This is really bad. At least regen goes off now. Regen's really powerful on these uh, resistant units. Yeah, man, I should have brought a holy user. I thought about it too. <laughs> I'm gonna regret it real bad. I can already feel it. Oh, he actually just passed. Interesting. I don't think they have any way to interrupt me, so. Just waiting. So decide her fate wore off, right? Accuracy and critical are still up, though. That's interesting. Hmm. I have to, might have to go for a quick and double kill on Sasha. We're gonna try to do some sort of uh, double kill here, or double tap. I right, still can't hit either of them. I got chain with myself, so and I can move back next turn. Can you enjoy this? <clears throat> Might be able to cast flare. Oh no, I can't cast flare. Loose crit. Nope, okay. Left her at basically nothing, so she's an easy finish for Nasha. Actually, Nasha can't get in range, which is a little rough. Yeah, this team's tough. Note to self, definitely need a holy user. <laughs> I think it maybe Solera actually would be fine, but. 8% to hit. Whew. Move here to kind of block Miranda a little bit. I don't want Murmur to die, but she is kind of the punching bag of the team. Here comes something. <laughs> if he passes turn, he gets another turn. That's insane. <laughs> that is a fast Shadow Lynx. 92 agility, yep. It's Katona at 94. Wow. Oh, man. 
Force Illusion again. I don't have any form of Dispel either. Yeah, I don't have an answer for these evasive units. But they can't really hurt Nasha too much, and I have a lot of heals. And if I can keep my guys alive, maybe I win by time. Maybe I have to kill the, finish killing the Sasha, and then. Ooh, can I confuse if I don't if I miss? I don't think I can. Can't tell what he's doing. So we'll just haste again. Probably gonna sharpshoot on the uh, Sasha. Although if Sasha has, does he have movement up? Oh no, okay. Oh man. Just gotta wait out this TP. Okay, regen's pretty good for that. He said LOL GG, what? He said he had Ketone's back, so he thought the game was over. Oh. Ooh, that's not good. Alright, we're gonna have to go for some greediness here. Saintly Cross. Well dodged, I'm yep. Yeah, I can't win this. This is frustrating. Oh, evasion, evasion. I have, to, I have to kill the one, but oh, I can't. I yep, I I panicked just there. Yeah, that's game. Jeez, GG. Oh man, so bad. It's really hard to deal with. Oh man, I'm tanky. <laughs> so I have to have Nasha kill the Sasha, but I think Sasha's gonna move first. Right? Oh no, I get next move after Katone. So he's gotta like I don't his sub soldier, so he can't use stop. Interesting. Once he runs out of TP though, I wonder, I wonder how that's gonna work. She's almost out though, but she's got a lot. <laughs> Confusion, excellent. Yeah, I have to get her off the table. We gotta get them back in range of each other though. Get ready. Sure he can, chaining with himself. This is really hard. That's enough to do a shuriken or something. Yeah, I needed some kind of guaranteed hit. Jeez. There goes Paladin's guard. Excellent. I can at least turtle pretty well. Oh, yes, we got it. Sweet. Uh, 
let's face this way though. So you just have to stall. He has no way to heal, so if I can keep my heals up, be solid. I'm gonna heal most of that health back. This chain could be bad though if he had he, he can't dream within a dream, but use something at least. Please don't die. Come on, Paladin Guard, proc again. 1500 health, oof. Nightmare. Interesting. He's gonna go again. Huh. 29% to hit. Like 2% to hit. really greedy but it comes out fast enough oh this is so difficult <laughs> oh i have no idea what to do you can get behind me but it has no ap you can't Ooh, that, make, that lets me run away oh can i win by healing i might be able to win by healing oh yes he doesn't have ap Oh, I'm gonna win by turtling. It doesn't feel good, but like, neither does not being able to hit my opponent ever. <laughs> Even when I have an Excalibur on one of my teammates, or on my characters. Uh, it's gonna go that, cast, attack. I'm, I might win by damage. The lame way to win, but. I'm just hoping he doesn't have enough damage here. Okay, cool. That should all come back. Alright. It's down to however much damage this thing can do. Oh, I'm so nervous. Oh, I got it. Oh my god. What a... He said that was fucked up. Prodigy from the future. Uh, yeah, that match was really rough back and forth. Uh, you could kind of hear the despair growing in my voice as it went on. Uh, but it's one of those things, like, we both had kind of what some might consider toxic ways to win, so evasion is a thing, and he went with that. Uh, I had a super defensive turtley team, and that's all I had to do. Uh, got my one hit in on a 63% to hit, and just stalled it out from there. Uh, I really had, like, if I just sat there trying to hit him over and over, I would have just died. Like, yeah, one in five hits on a 20%. That exists, but it's not, it's not gonna be reliable. Uh, so I just had to pivot, heal up, and win that way. Um, yeah. GG to Sidra. Uh, sorry it ended like that, but that's the game. See you in the next round.